Hello, 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 hello everyone and welcome to my channel. My name is Francesca. Today we're going to do a leg workout. You need two sets of different equipment. You're going to need a resistance band since we're doing this at home and not at a gym with a door anchor. So this is a resistance band and a door anchor, anchor and you're going to need the straps that hook up onto your legs, or the second option would be just to put this around your ankle. Be better if you had those Velcro straps, but sometimes we gotta do what we gotta do. Next thing we're gonna need is a barbell. You could totally do this exercise, this workout with dumbbells, but I highly recommend doing with a barbell. All right, so we're gonna get started with our warm up. Move your equipment away. Make sure you're not going to step or trip on it. Let's start off with a three minute warm up. All right, three, two, one, let's go. Let's get some jumping jacks going. So while we do this warm up, I'm gonna tell you which exercises that we're going to be doing. We're gonna do back squat. We're gonna do a back grip squat which be, would be a nice substitute instead of having a leg press or a hack squat at your house. I highly doubt any of you have a leg press or a hack squat at your house. If you do, I'm so happy for you. <laughs> Maybe a tiny bit jealous. All right, bring those knees up. Okay, next thing after that, we're gonna do some leg extensions. Romanian deadlifts, lying leg curls. We're gonna do also leg extensions. We're gonna do some crunches and oblique work. Really get those hips, those knees up. Okay, let's squat, deadlift, and good morning. Squat, deadlift, good morning. Here, squat, deadlift, Good morning, keep that back nice and straight. Yes, we're gonna be doing squats, that left. All right, maybe two more. Good. We really don't have to do upper body warm up because today's a leg day. So let's get some circles. Make believe maybe you have a hula hoop around those hips. Keep that hula hoop going. All right, go the other way. Big to small. Good. Bring those feet close together. You're gonna squat and you're gonna open up one leg. This might be your left leg or right leg. Five four, three, two, one, other leg, right, one, two, three, four, five, nine, and ten, all right, we're not going to be doing jumps, but I still love to get that range of motion in those ankles, other way, switch feet, circle, 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 other way. All right, let's point and flex. Okay. I highly recommend, I love working out without my shoes on. Sometimes the shoes that you're wearing are compressing your feet so much. That's time, we did three minute walk. Our first exercise, we have four sets of it, but I want you, if you're gonna start off with a heavier weight, maybe go with a 20 pound barbell or 20 pounds on, on, your, on your back. Or if you're not, if you're doing, you're starting off with 20 pounds, start off with regular squats. Let's do about nine or eight squats down and up. I want you to look at your feet really quick. On my feet, gripping the floor. Are my abs engaged? Let's do four, three, two, and one. Maybe shake it out or not. 
It's up to you. I'm going to set a timer for 30 seconds in between each set. 30 seconds is not a lot of time, so that's going to be a quick water break. Stay away from your phones. I think having your phone during a workout is probably the most distracting thing. With the new ISO software, 13 or whatever it is, 12 for the, for the iPhones, you could go into focus mode and you could basically be like, don't disturb me while I'm working out. That's what I have set right now. So 30 seconds are up. Get that weight. You're going to get low, All right? Nine to 10. Get it on the back. Engage our core. We're going 10, 11. 9 to 10. 10. 10. That's 11. Drop it. We got 30 seconds. Breathe, maybe grab water. Maybe you're here and you have a notebook, which is really handy. Tally off how many sets you did. Always write down what weight, you work, what weight you're working with. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one time is up grab that barbell <gasps> remember engage that core <sighs> okay look at your feet my feet good my knees good All right, that's 11, nine to 11. Get that time going, we got 30 second rest. Oh, maybe grab your water. All right, this is for my people who are doing, who have, who have dumbbells. Oh, 11, 10, nine, eight, seven, Six, two, and one. All right, let's go. Grab that weight. Here, okay. Drop that weight. Timer is on. Whew. All right. Please make sure you're breathing. Do not hold your breath. Okay. Whew. Nine, eight, seven. This is our fourth set. Four, three, two, and one. Let's go, let's go. Look at those feet. Engage that core. If you're going anything heavier than 45 pounds, I suggest you get a squat rack or someone there to assist you. This is six. Seven, eight, nine, 
And that's it for our first exercise. Whew. We got 30 seconds of rest. Maybe for the next workout, you are increasing your weight or decreasing it. Maybe you couldn't even get to eight reps. The thing is, I want you to get to, I want you to be uncomfortable. Good, time is up. All right, grab your barbell. Right? Put it behind you. <sighs> yeah, it's too hot to have my hair everywhere. Barbell behind you. Touch that barbell with your legs. I always like to have it. I have to have it even. Go pretty wide. Right? Engage that core. <sighs> right? Your back is still nice and straight. Don't concave or hunchback of Notre Dame. We're not doing that today. <sighs> Grab it. Up. Two. Three. Come on. Eight. Come on. Nine. I could only do nine. Maybe you're doing your 10th, maybe you're doing your 11th, and that is time. 30 second rest. And it's starting. One set done. Three more to go. I wanna show you a different way. Right? And one, time is up. Grab that weight. Feet are nice and straight. Feet are shoulder width apart. <laughs> Engage our core. right below that those shoulder, those knees that's nine ten and eleven I only did eight set eight reps that's the second set rest is starting right now resting 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 oh my gosh I feel that in my legs already breathe Grab your water. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. This barbell is definitely longer than my mats. And I always want to have good form. Your form is always number one. You go as fast or as slow as you want. Engage that core. Open up that chest. Hey, I feel a little bit uneven, right? Now I feel even. One. Two. Come on, you got it. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Maybe you're on your tenth. 11, time, let's rest it out. We have one more set. Actually, no, that was our last set. We're only doing three sets of that one. You go ahead, pause the video if you wanna do that fourth set, you're more than welcome. So in between this set, we're gonna have one minute of rest. I don't know about you, maybe your legs don't need it, but my legs definitely need it. With this one minute, you're gonna have to set up your different equipment. All right, 
this video is in no way sponsored by anybody but the last link in my description redman electrolytes this is what i'm drinking right now it takes some time to dissolve but i love this stuff i've been looking around for electrolytes and i've been having drinking electrolytes for a long time and this is the best one i've ever had so far there's no colors added to it like artificial color number red or blue or whatever you don't want to have that junk in your body I'm having pina colada taste and just making believe I'm on a beach right now. All right, that is time, one minute. Let's set up for our next exercise. Okay, next exercise, we're gonna do some deadlifts, but we're just gonna stop right below our knees. When we're doing deadlifts, first off, set yourself up for a success. All right, grip those feet, legs are shoulder width apart, okay? Bar is as close to your ankles as possible. Some people like to go in um, using an in and out grip. I just like a neutral grip right now. All right, you're gonna grab, engage that core, open up that chest. Going nine to 11. Good, rest it out, 30 seconds. Rest it out, rest it out. Use this time to grab water, that's set number one. Five. Four, three, two, and one. Let's go, let's go. Set yourself up, all right? Open up that chest. Good, let's rest it out. Maybe that's just too easy for you. 30 seconds rest. Maybe that was like way too hard and you couldn't even get six reps in. Drop your weight. Too easy for you, that 11th rep was way too easy. Increase your weight. Five, four, three, two, and one. This is set number. Come on, everyone. This is three. Open up that chest. I think I need to step back just a little bit. One. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Good job, drop that weight, 30 second rest. We have one more set. Breathe, maybe grab water. Maybe it's cold where you are. Right now it's freezing in my location and I'm hot in my house right now. Three, two, one. That 30 seconds goes so quickly. Set yourself up. Engage our core. All right, we got one more set. 
This is number four. Engage our core, open up that chest. Smile. Three. Seven. All right, that's at number four. So if you do not have the resistance bands like I have right here, doesn't matter the color, if you just don't have them, you're gonna skip on to the ab exercises and I'm gonna link or write down the time in the description box so you can just fast forward. Okay, so now we're going into seated leg extensions. I'm gonna show you two options. The first option is you have the Velcro straps that wrap around your wrists or your legs, or you have you don't have that option. All right, I highly suggest getting this option. I'll show you why. So I wanna make this resistance resistant. <laughs> I don't know the best word to explain that, but I want it to be really like, I want to have a challenge. So I'm going to keep this, the foot that I'm not extending out, I'm going to keep it really far out. All right, I'm going to sit up nice and tall, and you're going to go up and down. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Now I'm going with the non Velcro side now, and you'll see why. It's a pain. Seven, eight, nine, ten, and eleven. All right, we have thirty second rest. And we're gonna keep going. At this point, maybe you need to add a second loop. Cause sometimes these resistance bands, I'll link the resistance bands that I have in the description. So they come with like another col like three colors green I mean orange or yellow or blue or something if you got the blue right now you could put on another resistant band on the loop time is up we're doing 11 on each side well 9 to 11 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10, 11. Good, switch sides. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Thirty 10, 11. 30 seconds in five, four, three, two. All right, and I was explaining that right now I'm hooked up to my treadmill, my treadmill which is probably not the safest option but I think at this point, I know my treadmill is not going anywhere. We have one more set of this. If you have a door frame and you have that door frame hook, which is still on my resistance band, you could hook this up on your door. All right, time is up. Let's go. I'm gonna pull out even more. This is too easy for me. Eight, nine, 10, 11, switch sides. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and 11. We are done. So the next exercise we have, we have three sets of nine to 11 or 12 reps. All right, you're gonna be laying on your stomach. I have the uh, each resistance on both feet. Keep them on both feet, because if you let go of one, the other one's just gonna come flying back to you. All right, so lay down and keep one foot planted and curl. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And 11, switch sides. One, two, three, four, five, 
six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and eleven. We have thirty seconds left. I'm just gonna stay laying down right here. Oh, maybe sing a song in your head or watch your dog sleep. Whiskey. Yeah, he's sleeping right now. All right, we have 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. We have one more set right after this. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. I know probably after those deadlifts, your legs are super sore. Ready? Switch sides. And you don't want to do any more deadlifts or hamstring work. Trust me. We have one more. That's 11. And let's rest it out. Twenty seconds left. Please take this time to rest. Maybe using this rest to add more resistance, like I should be doing right now, because this is nothing for me. All right, in five, four, three, two, one, let go. Last set. I'm gonna start on a like two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, nine, ten. Oh, I missed one. Eleven, eleven, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. And we are done with the resistant bands. The next exercise is going to be ab work. Next thing that you're going to have handy, which you probably already still have out from the last exercise, the last two exercises, All right? Grab those resistant bands. Place one foot in the middle. You don't want your resistance band to be like loose like this. You want some tightness, right? So that's nice and tight with me, okay? Maybe a little bit tighter. We're gonna do 20 side dips. Let's do 10 each. One, see that's still two, two less for me. Not good enough for me. I have about maybe four or five inches on this side. And go, stand up nice and tall. Eight, nine, ten. Switch sides. All right, I'm gonna try to do the same length on this side. And let's go. See, it's still too little. We're doing 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. I'm going to give about 15 seconds. So 15, 14, 15, 12, 11, 10, 9, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, one, let's go. You should be already set up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Switch sides. Now, when you're doing this, your back is nice and straight. You shouldn't be leaning over. Two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 
this exercise is not your unarm movement. This is your obliques, the side muscle of your abs, moving this, these, this resistance band. We have 10 on each side, and then we are done. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel. Ready, let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Usually some people suck it in this wrist movement like this. I want your wrist nice and straight. But if you have any wrist problems or your wrists hurt you, please don't do this. <laughs> All right, last 10. <laughs> Let's go. One, two, three, four, five. I'm a little teapot, short and stout. <laughs> two, and one. Tip me over and pour me out. That's what that exercise reminds you of. So I hope you enjoy this workout. Don't forget to stretch and also, of course, like and subscribe to my videos and I will see you next week. Bye. <clears throat> All right, so the next thing we're gonna do is some crunches, weighted crunches, obviously. All right, we're gonna do three sets of 20 with 30 second rest, right? So get those arms up and let's go. Ten, nine, eight, seven. Get those shoulders off the ground. I think that's three, two, and one. Rest it out. We have 30 seconds rest. Five, four, three, two, and one. Engage that core. Your back should be flat on the ground. Up. Come on, 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. 30 seconds rest. Whew, hope you're feeling good at the end of this workout. I sure am. I'm probably going to be taking my time going up and down the stairs for maybe today and tomorrow. Even who knows, maybe then for the next day. <laughs> All right, we have 10. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Engage our core. Go on, ten, nine, eight, seven, six. One, and we are done with those weeded crunches.